This is my triple monitor setup sharing between two computers. Computer 1 Intel Mac, Computer 2 M1 Mac using KVM switch. Just with a click of button, I can share the entire triple monitor between two computers. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna walk through the step-by-step -step process. How did I set up the KVM um, to connect three monitors to share between two computers, that is a Mac one, that is Intel Mac here, and then the M1 Mac here, and uh, with a single keyboard, and I'm gonna switch between computer one to computer two and switch back from computer two to computer one using my keyboard short key and i'm not using any shared mouse because i don't use any wide mouse so the kvm doesn't have any mouse connected to it's just only one keyboard uh, i like the the steel series apex pro keyboard uh, this is one of the best keyboard i ever tested so that's why i use this keyboard and uh, so I leave the information in the description about each and every uh, product I have it on this desk. But, uh, so this is a keyboard, it's a only one connected to the KVM. Whereas I use uh, two different trackpad and two different mouse for each computer. How to set up a KVM switch between two dock station so that I can share three different monitors between my personal computer that is connected to a call digit plus TS3 plus dock station and my work computer that is connected to a star, star deck um, dock station. So, so this is my uh, kind of a diagram that I put together how I can connect to uh, three different monitors between two different docking stations. So basically I want to share the monitor, keyboard and mouse and also any audio peripherals and anything uh, that I want to share between two different dock stations so that um, I can switch uh, between um, my personal computer versus my work computer with the click of button. So, so this is the KVM switch that uh, I am going to use. So this is basically uh, two port triple monitor display port KVM switch. So it's basically uh, it uses the the display port uh, to share between the uh, two different dock station. Uh, you can also directly connect to the computer, but uh, I prefer to use the dock station because you know the dock station has its own advantage to plug in multiple devices. So I already have uh, CalDigit Plus that is which is already. Uh, installed in my desk and also I have the, the Star Deck uh, the Thunderbolt 3 dock station that is already connected to my desk. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, use the KVM switch that can connect to both dock station, the CalDigit 3 Plus as well as the, the Star Deck uh, dock station so that uh, and I also am going to connect to the monitor directly to the KVM switch. So if you look at this, uh, the small diagram that I put together, so I have three monitors. Okay, so all three monitors going to use the, the display port. So, and that directly connects to the KVM. So, which is basically, I'm going to use the output uh, for display port. So this output directly goes to the monitor. So from KVM switch to monitor, I'm gonna use these three output display port. Now, if you look at the, the left side of the, the picture, meaning the diagram, so you have again three display port that I can connect to my dock station. Since the CalDigit Plus doesn't have the, the display port, meaning all it, that it has only one display port in this case so how i'm going to do so one display port i'm going to use it directly the second display port i'm going to use the 
I'm going to use the uh, C to display. So USB C to display port adapter. So if I show you this guy, so this is, this basically converts from USB C to so USB C to a, a display port. So this is a one um, a converter that I'm going to use. Then I have a uh, one more. Um, connector which is using the USB C drive so I'm gonna use USB 3.0 to display port external video card so if you open this guy um, So this comes with a, so this comes with a, a display port on the other side and the USB 3 3.0. So what I'm going to use one um, USB C port, okay, that uh, the two the display port using this guy, and then a USB. A port so you have multiple USB A ports so I can use any one of the USB A port okay that can directly connect uh, to the monitor to, sorry, to the KVM using the display adapter so 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 in that case so I can use all three dis three display port okay to KVM switch uh, using the converter uh, one with the USB C port the other one with the USB A port so so if you see that this one do goes to the dock station okay then the dock station from the dock station you have the computer so if you see this this is a thunderbolt 3 computer cable that that directly goes to my personal uh, mac or my personal computer now coming to the other side uh, it's the same setup again uh, it's good that uh, both uh, dock station uh, has a similar setup so what I'm going to do one display port that directly goes to uh, this display port in the dock station if you see here and then the second one again I'm going to use the uh, same converter from USB uh, C to display port so I can use uh, one of them if you see here I can connect two different monitors uh, one directly goes to the computer using the Thunderbolt 3 cable but this one it goes to the monitor so i'm going to use this one to the monitor and then i'm going to use uh, one of the usb a port that can use this one and that can connect to the kvm switch i know it's kind of a little bit confusing um, so in this case so how many so i need two usb 3.0 cables to connect uh, to my dock station and then I need a USB-C display port adapter that is two of them because I have two display um, uh, converter and then I also need two display port uh, using USB-A port then I need totally nine display port cables so if you see here I have three here and I have three here and I have three here so totally I need nine of them so this is why I bought I bought nine uh, display port cables so with this setup I should be able to uh, share uh, my monitor between two dock station using the KVM switch so I'm gonna set up this one and I'm gonna show you how I set up and uh, then I'll share more information The first thing I wanted to show you is the the monitor input. So this is the first thing that you see here is basically a monitor input. So to start with, the first step is to connect the input from the monitor. So all these three display port are connected directly from each monitor. So we call it as an input. So each of this uh, cable comes from each monitor. So to show you, so this, this is my uh, right monitor and I have connected the 
uh, display port and make sure you don't have you don't use any other port like hdmi or usb c because every monitor comes with a multiple way to connect uh, make sure that you don't use any other port to connect because the monitor might uh, take time to recognize the display port and uh, coming to the left side monitor this is my display port that goes to kvm and similarly the center one also has a display port and thus connect directly to the kvm so this is your step one then step two uh, you see that there are two outputs it can one goes to this dock station which is connected to my computer one this is my second output that connects to the second dock station which is connecting to my computer too that is m1 mac the purpose i showed both computer open is to just to show you guys why i have two computer right now having the display on so precisely if you see i have four display including three display along with a, a mac display which means if you want to use the mac display you can use it always you can just uh, close the lid and you can probably keep it on the side so that you will have more space in the desk but just to show you guys the setup i have opened both lid of each mac now if you look at this guy so all output comes uh, using the display port but whereas in case of the dock station the dock station doesn't have the display port which is where you need you will be using the the adapters right um, so if you see here um, this is my thunderbolt cable and this is the USB-C which is connected again to a thunderbolt port which provides a one display output that goes to the KVM and then if you see one other USB-A using the display link so I have a one USB-A port goes to KVM one Thunderbolt port goes to KVM and then the display port so this is my uh, display port so so I have the similar setup here on my second dock station the first one connecting from USB-A using the adapter to display link and software and then second one is the USB-C the third one is the display port so right now the computer one is connected to all the monitors and that's why if you see here it says it's on number one right now I'm gonna use the short key in the keyboard to switch to computer two There you go. So now it is connected to computer too. And if you can see, the KVM is now pointing to computer too. I now need a remote for the KVM to switch between computer or I need to stretch myself to press this button. I can simply use the keyboard short key. You need to press control two times and then press one or two depending on which computer you want to switch to so that's all about the kvm setup guys i hope you guys uh, understood or followed the steps please uh, feel free to leave your comments questions and i request everyone to like the video and subscribe to my channel